All right, thanks, Anne. Well, four fallen war heroes will be honored at the state legislature tomorrow with the Hawaii Medal of Honor. Among them, Army Chief Warrant Officer Edward Bailly, Army Sergeant Drew Scobie, Air Force Captain Reed Nishizuka, and Army Sergeant Sofia Tautolo. Now, joining us this morning is Michael uh, Donos, uh, son of the late U.S. Army Chief Warrant Officer to Edward Bailly, State Representative Mark Takai, who created the Hawaii Medal of Honor. Thanks so much for being here this morning. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, well, uh, Michael, tell me about about your dad. Um, the fourth uh, deployment. Right. Yes. Um, you know, to tell the truth, he really never talked about his uh, what he did. Um, every time he talked to us, is all about family and what we were doing and how were the kids and you know he was always family first. Um, he, he loved my mom, um, all of us and his grandchildren and um, he just always wanted to know what we were doing. Yeah. Yeah. Hasn't been that long, January. Right, January 20th. How's everybody doing? Um, doing all right. We have our days. but. So recently, um, you heard about the Hawaii Medal of Honor. Uh, mm -hmm. What does this mean to you and your family? I mean, it, it's a great honor. I mean, just to have him recognized in this way um, by a place that he loved dearly in his heart. He loved Hawaii so much. The people, the food, the music, you know. Um, they even dubbed him the Flying Hawaiian <laughs> back uh, with his soldiers. So that's how much. He loved this state. Well, Representative Takai, you were saying that it's been, I think, nine years, do you say, since you um, um, initiated the Hawaii Medal of Honor. Why, why was this so important to you for this to happen? Well, actually, we, I don't think we could comprehend back then how significant this medal was going to be to many people, uh, like this family and many others. Uh, we have, uh, since we started, uh, delivered 331 medals to, to families. and. You know, it's, it's very important because it, it, it honors them and it most importantly tells them that they're part of Hawaii and part of our ohana. And uh, for a state that cares so deeply about the military, um, this is important for us to do, I believe, as much as for the families receiving this medal. So many Hawaii families serving our country. Thank you, Michael, for being here. Thank you, Representative mm -hmm. Takai. Thank you. That ceremony coming up at 2 o'clock tomorrow at the state capitol.